Our partners over at GWW dropped a huge exclusive today and are reporting that the Red Hulk is going to appear in the She-Hulk series. Let's break it down. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia. I'm CB Nostalgia and we got a little update on the She-Hulk series. But first, make sure you get in on this month's giveaway. We're giving away a copy of JLA 1 Million. To get in on the giveaway, all you have to do is be a subscriber, hit like, and leave a comment. Well, if you've been a fan of this channel for a while, you know we did our Gamma Power Future of the MCU video a couple months ago, and bits and pieces of it appear to be coming true one piece at a time. Our partners over at GWW dropped a huge exclusive scoop today, and I wanted to break it down for you guys. Now, according to Thomas Polito, who's dropped several confirmed scoops over on the site, the Red Hulk will actually make his debut in the She-Hulk Disney Plus series. Now, as we know, William Hurt will appear in The Black Widow, and the report says it'll actually be a cameo. And it's fairly likely he'll appear in The Falcon and the Winter Soldier. But sources are telling Geeks Worldwide that the appearance of his superpowered alter ego, the Red Hulk, will happen in the She-Hulk series. Now, it's unclear when this will happen in the series, or if he'll be the primary antagonist, or just something the series closes out building itself around. Remember, we're hearing rumblings of that Thunderbolt series, and the Red Hulk would fit perfectly in that. Now, General Ross has a long history in Marvel Comics, but made his first appearance as the Red Hulk in Hulk number one in 2008. Now, a lot of people like to call him Rolk, and in his initial issue, he actually kills the Abomination. In the comics, it was revealed he was actually created by MODOK, the leader of AIM, when She-Hulk infiltrates an AIM base and actually fights MODOK. These are all really interesting pieces to me because they would all fit perfectly in the MCU right about now. Now, this whole thing could imply that they have some plans for MODOK in the future of the MCU, if not here in the She-Hulk series. I would also tag on to that, they canceled the MODOK animated series over on Hulu, so maybe Kevin Feige didn't want anybody else touching that character. Also again, I wanted to reiterate those Thunderbird rumblings, where the Red Hulk is a key member of that team. I can't imagine Marvel doing that without him, because I think they're going to try to make them out to be some sort of darkish Avengers, and you need a Hulk to fill out the ranks. Now, all we know right now is Rick and Morty's Jessica Gao is set up to serve as showrunner for the She-Hulk, and there's no premiere date on Disney Plus as of yet. But obviously, as soon as we get more details, we're going to bring him your way, immediately. So I'm really curious on what you guys think. Are you ready for some Red Hulk action in the MCU? And what do you think of him making his premiere appearance in the She-Hulk series? Make sure you sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.